evening everyone happy monday hope everyone is having a blessed and positive monday this far monday morning i am i just got back and from dropping off the children and then i stopped by one of my favorite um restaurant biscuit and y'all Please tell me. So, I, I, I ordered a um, country ham biscuit. That's usually what I get. Either the combo or sometimes I just get like the country ham biscuit and a side of grits. Today, I just got a country ham biscuit and I wanted an a extra biscuit. I wanted a, um, they call it a butter biscuit. No, they asked me that I want butter on it. I said, yes. Tell me why. Tell me why. When I got around to the first window to hear my total they told me six something i was like six something why is why is my thing six something because my my uh country hand biscuit i believe it's like three dollars and some change so i'm believing that a plain biscuit okay um with or without butter is somewhere between this, this this my belief system going on this morning okay i'm believing a plain biscuit with or without butter is going to run me about what the most uh, a dollar okay so, uh, yeah the most maybe not even a dollar got over there she told me six something i said hold up ma'am why is it six something i said um and she's like because it was um because of the butter biscuit i said well how much is the butter biscuit <laughs> she told me the butter biscuit and actually let me see let me see. I got my receipt right here because of something off. So let me let me see. Uh, no, this ain't this ain't the correct one. Something still off. Maybe my ham biscuit might have been for something. Okay, so that sounds a little bit better. Um, you know, with tax and everything, it's three eighty nine. I think with tax to come out to for something. Anyway, back to this daggone butter biscuit. I said, ma'am, why, why is my butter biscuit $2.19? Because she says $2.19. I'm like, what? For a butter biscuit? Y'all, I almost had to take my whole rag off my head, honey, because I was about Why? For a biscuit, a plain biscuit with some butter on it, why is it $2.19? I could have came home, got my sifter, my flour, everything I need to make my own daggone biscuits, okay? I could have made about 10, 12 biscuits myself and put my own butter on it, okay? What the piss? Why is a butter biscuit two nineteen? And she stood up there. She just falling out laughing, honey. She, she just having a good old time kicking. And I'm, and I'm like dead serious. And then she finally said, everything going up honey but i'm thinking to myself a bit a plain biscuit with a piece of butter on it done went up to two dollars and 19 cent i said brown eyes if you don't keep your from over there okay i was too through honey i was too through but i wanted me a plain biscuit because i had asked for my honey package to go on top of two dollars and nine yeah, I'm feeling some type of way about that. Do better, Biscuitville. Do better. Okay, on any place that had a biscuit, they want to charge $2.19 for a daggum slap of butter on there. Yeah, I'm feeling some type of way this morning. But anywho, okay, I digress. Anywho, we're going to move off of there. <laughs> Ooh, we're going to move off of there. So, yeah. This the biscuit, y'all. Let me show. This the biscuit. Look, where the butter? Child, they probably didn't even put that much butter on there. Can I see? Ooh, this gonna teach me that this gonna teach me everything I need to know, honey. Fix your and home and fix your own breakfast. And I could have, I could have, but I, I'd already fixed the babies their breakfast. I fixed them pancakes. I should have fixed me some pancakes while I was fixing theirs, but. I didn't, okay? And I hadn't even really, this was a spur of the moment thing, because I hadn't even really um, wanted Biscuitville. I wanted Starbucks, and so I did go over there to Starbucks, because usually in the mornings I go and I get my venti water, because I love their water. And I was over there, I said, well, shoot, okay, let's see. I asked him, I said, do you have your fall stuff out? 
um, your fall items? And she said, yes. And then she started naming off things. I said, well, do you have the fall croissant, the apple uh, croissant? Because I had one when I was on my little mini trip. So, dang, I'm good. If you have it, try them. Get to Starbucks and try them. Um, and so, she, she looked and she said, um, I don't know. Let me see. We was, like, kind of running low. So, let me see. And I was like, okay. She was just happy, honey. I said, wow, y'all really happy this morning. I mean, she was just bouncing, okay? She was bouncing. <laughs> and so she came back and she said, we do. We have like one left because I wanted two. And she said, we only have one left. We do have one. We only have one left. I said, okay, well, I'll take it. I'll take it. I wanted two, but I'll take that one, okay? I was like, oh, my gosh. These people be up early out here in these streets uh, buying up stuff, okay? So, yeah, that's supposed to be my breakfast. I'm going to eat that little, um, that other biscuit, like, later on, something like a little, um, I don't know, something, something later on, okay? But, yeah, y'all. That's how my morning is going, honey. Okay, so far. So, what I'm getting ready to do now is I got to clean up. I need to, um, looking around, I need to clean my dresser off and stuff. Because you know how, like, your dresser sometimes become like, your catch-all. So, mine has caught all. <laughs> it's not going to catch anymore, okay? So, I need to, you know, get up and, and straighten up some things while the children is do. So that's what I'm going to do. And also, um, it's raining today. And so I wanted to do my porch, but I don't see no one around the neighborhood. They got their stuff, um, you know, in fall yet or in Halloween. It's just one lady that lived down the street from me. She be on it, y'all. She be on it on every holiday. She, she got... I mean, she got this big old display of something, honey. Okay, every holiday, I used to be that one. Okay, but she done, she done came because I've been slacking off like for some years. All right, but um, I was like, dang, she ain't got her stuff up yet. Okay, so I was going to put my stuff up <laughs> before she got hers up, but um, it's raining and stuff, and it's storming really bad. Um and stuff, so I don't know when I'm going to get to do that. It's supposed to be raining all week, I think. Woo! So, yeah, y'all. Mm, 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 mm. So, I'm about to get off here and stop running my mouth. I usually don't talk this long with y'all, but I said, you know, I had to tell y'all about the deck on Butter Biscuit, okay? Because, yeah, I washed my hair last night, y'all. It's, um, I wanted to leave it, like, curly, and so I put it into, like, two little, um, twist so when i take it a loose i just wet it and just let it be like the curls and stuff so yeah that's why i got this on uh it's not ready to be taking a look <laughs> be a bush before i get in there and get to some water but um yeah y'all that's about all i have going on for this morning i'm getting ready to eat clean rest and I will see y'all sometime today. If not, if I don't pick this camera back up today, I will see you on Tuesday. Okay? All right, y'all.
Alright y'all, so for dinner tonight, I'm going to be making uh, fried tilapia. And then I picked up like three bags of these from all the different ones. So I, I think I'm going to make this Southwest Fiesta salad. It's brown rice with black beans. What is that? Quino corn and grilled red peppers. Right here it says serve heated or chilled. And of course we're going to have ours. Um, hmm. How do I want it? I think we're going to have ours heated. Uh -huh. But yeah, they had different ones of these, y'all. So I cannot wait to uh, taste this. So I'll be back. Tuesday everyone so I'm out here in the foyer I just wanted to remind you all what it looks like before I start to redecorate that is the top this is the bottom I'm not sure if I'm going to keep some things at the bottom or not but we shall see later on because I have to get everything together hey y'all happy Tuesday welcome back to the vlog hope everyone is having a blessed and positive day thus far I am. The sun is shining. It's cool and crisp outside. And I do believe I ran over some leaves. So that's a good indication the leaves are going to start changing not too long from now. Okay, so your girl is feeling fabulous. Okay. <sighs> so, anywho, I'm sitting over here. I'm getting ready to watch one of my favorite um, YouTube vloggers on YouTube. Um, Gina Janine. I love to watch her. I love to watch her and her beasties or he or her besties um, because I think they're so entertaining and I live through them right now as far as the traveling. I live through them, okay? Because <laughs> one, I'm a little bit um, afraid to get on a plane. And then number two, I'm a little bit afraid when I get there to my destination, something gonna go left. Okay, so I am living vicariously. What is it? Vic vicariously through them. Okay, so yeah, that's what I'm about to watch her right now. And like I said, I watch her other friends um, as well too. I think she's a really cool, down to earth uh, person, as well as her friends. I like her personality seems real genuine and like i said she seems like she's really cool but anywho while i'm sitting here i'm about to try these baked bread bites sour cream and onion right here plan for 50 cent february 13th 2024 had to make sure <laughs> so yeah y'all that's what i'm doing and then like two hours ago i just got back from eating lunch with Sun Sun. And before I went, so I had um, straightened my hair. Okay. I showed a little clip of that in this video where I straightened my hair with the uh, Tymo or whatever it is and put it back in a ponytail. Okay. So today, today, I bit crimped it. You know, I, I, um, did I plait it up last night? No, I put it in a plaited ponytail last night. And I took it loose and it was had some little waves in it and everything. Y'all know I'm naturally curly, okay? It only takes a drop of water and, and the curls start popping. Uh, but I, um, I had straightened it, took it loose, and it was giving, you know, some little crinkles. I said, well, let me go in the closet and get the big crinklers, okay? And, you know, just help it out a little bit. So I did that. Went to eat lunch. Went to Rose's. Came back home and this is how it's looking right here. So I really, it won't let me be great. The only time my hair will stay straight and and it's for like I would say maybe three four days. Okay, almost a week is when I go and get it. Um, what's that thing called? Uh, a blowout? Is it a blowout? No, a silk press. When I go and get a silk press, that's the only time. Okay. Other than that, 
we dealing with with this right here <laughs> and it's cool outside and it's already still um uh, doing what it wants to do so i said you know what i'm just gonna let it let it do what it do i actually like it i'm gonna let it do what it do and that's gonna be the end of it okay <sighs> so let me try these real quick and i think these are a food line if you have a food line these are a food line they smell good they look hard as piss well excuse me hard as a rock <laughs> all right let me see amen now that darn dog be getting on my deck on nerve all right this is what they look like right here all right Mmm, mmm, they're good. I like them. See, now I'm not going to the bottom line. I'm going to have me a beverage and have these right here. These are really good. I'm going to have to go back to the grocery store. Let's see. I'm going to ask if you get, if um they have any more different types of flavors other than this. Because, yeah, I like these a lot. I don't want to do too much smacking. A lot of people can't stand smacking. Um, I can take it or leave it, just depending. But if you're sitting up there doing it a lot, a lot, like I was on that piece of ginger. <laughs> mm. I can understand it. Y'all excuse me. I bumped my little desk over there. I got this little, um, little, uh, it's not a tripod, but it's another type of phone holder. And I absolutely love it. I got it off the Dollar Tree. Plus section for five dollars. I should have got two. I'm gonna have to go back and get another one. I absolutely love it. And whenever I use my camera, I will show. Well, I show you. Um. All right. Well, let me show y'all. Hold on. Okay. So this right here, I purchased from the plus section at Dollar Tree. When I tell you all, I love this daggum thing. O M G. So I absolutely love it, you all. It was it is one of the best little inexpensive phone holders that I have had in a while. Okay, it's better than that tripod that I got from Walmart that got like the little three things on there and it's supposed to be bendable and stuff. That thing got on my daggum nerves. That's why it's in the bottom of the junk drawer now. <laughs> That thing got on my nerve, but when I needed it at the time, it served its purpose until it started going all wonky. Mm -mm. Junk drawer. I need to go and take it out the junk drawer. Throw it away. Yep. Watch my girl. Put these baked bites down. Okay, girl. Sister girl called herself trying to lose some uh, about twenty five pounds before. What did I say? November, and then I told somebody, I said, I don't know if that's going to work either, because you know November is Thanksgiving, and that's when you have all the good foods, and then I said, well, let me shoot for December, December, <laughs> December not going to work either, that's when you have some more good cooking, and then January is when you got your black eyed peas, your cornbread, your collard greens, and stuff like that, so... I'm going to make a conscious effort to get my tail up and lose 25 pounds. Okay, real tall. Um, because I want to dress in the cute little tops and the, and the things too. But even, I think even if I did lose 25 pounds, unless I'm doing something right here to bring the girls down, um, that's the only way they're going to come down. I remember last time, I know I said, I'm going to get off of here. Uh, last time when I used to go to work out, they shrunk. Okay, I went down two bra sizes. Okay, from doing the workouts. And I was like, oh my goodness. So, yeah. I'm going to have to make a conscious effort to get myself together. To really get myself in shape. Because, look, beautiful face, okay, doesn't mean anything too much. If the rest of your body is out of shape. 
okay and looking a hot mess all right so okay y'all so let me show you what i have um to possibly go over and replace the decor that i have out in the uh for you y'all so i went to marshall's and i found a few pieces that i thought was nice i picked this little arrangement up right here i thought it was really pretty now i'm going to try it out in the foyer first and then if it don't work then it's automatically going to go into the bathroom i sat there and i did so many little um what is it, examples to see how it would look together everything would look together now put some pictures up here so you can see uh kind of what i was thinking but i got that i thought this gold and cream pumpkin was really nice right here going with the uh, combination that I was putting together. So I ended up actually getting two of them. So here is the second one. Is the other uh, decor piece that I picked up. I picked up this vase, um, but it doesn't go deep like in the center. It's kind of like off more to the side if you even put anything in there at all. But yeah, I mainly got it just for um to stand with the other items so yeah those are my little purchases that i got to go out here in the foyer all right